welcome to this very first episode of Creature Type Sorcery. Today we're going to open these five sweet packs of Battle for Sendikar and uh, hopefully we'll get some expeditions or something other sweet cards. So why don't you join me over at the table and we'll start cracking. So let's get started. Let's start with Omnixilis because he's the big bad guy. Let's see what's in here. I think at Bone Splinters, that's pretty good removal. Sheer Drop. Guess an Eldrazi. Guess it's the rare we're most interested in, right? Here's a Stone Fury. A Thrall. See, that's the second uncommon. There's the third one. There's an Oran Reef Hydra. That's not too chabby. We have a mountain and a foiled complete disregard. And a filler card. Let's take this guy next. Or girl, I don't know. The only one I don't recognize. Selects Channeler, I like that guy. There's a Blighted Step. I really like this land cycle. I don't think this one is the best though. It's a Pilgrim's Eye, a Retreat to Emeria, Landfall. It's also one of my favorite words. Ulamog! Hulamog, welcome, sir. Damn, this card is sweet. Yeah, that's that's a good find. That's a really good find. And a plant token. Woo! Let's put Ulamog over there. Just speaking of big bad guys, huh? Ulamog, he's a big bad guy. He has Gideon. He's pretty boring. But hey, it's, it's a good card. Hope we open one of them. Voracious No. I still haven't really figured out how to hold the cards, but we'll, we'll work on that together. There's Evolving Wilds with a very beautiful picture. Damn, I love Evolving Wilds. The Ligrant Whiptail. There's Valakut Predator. See, here's the first uncommon Expeder expedition and what is Ulamog's reclaimer? Should we put that next to Ulamog like that? Spawning bed. We have a defiant brood lord, blood lord, not brood lord. Not everything can be a brood. Let's see, flying. Whenever you gain life, target opponent loses that much life. Four or five or six. Seven, even. Math is hard. Let's take another one of this dude I don't know. I'm pretty sure someone will tell me. Let's see. Inspired Charge. Calastra Healer. Smite the Monstrous. Spell Shrivel. Dominator Drone. That's a good name on a card. Dominator Drone. More Scouts, Mantis, Watchers. Let's get to the Uncommons. Retreat to Coral Helm. Yeah, I had a friend who, want, who tried this in Commander once. Mixed Results has another retreat. Now we open three of the five. The Serene Steward. And the next card is... Aligned Hedron Network. What a letdown. What a letdown. I don't want that. Hey, Reclaimer, you're not as cool as Ulamog. What? Well, you can't get a jackpot every time. Last booster, Kiora. The very 
sexy merfolk creature, planeswalker. I hope they print more cards than Kiora. She's pretty cool. So let's see. Let's rip through the commons pretty quick here. It's a snapping in our lid. I haven't seen that one before. Here we go. Another stasis snare. I think I opened one. It's a cryptic cruiser. Let's see if I can hold it still. It's devoid, two in a blue, put a card an opponent owns from exile into that place graveyard tap target creature. So you have to exile a lot of cards for that to be good. Morasa Ranger. And a sunken hollow. That's not too bad. Dual Lance is always sweet when you play a lot of commander. And uh, I don't think I had this one, so that's good. That's two very good cards out of five packs. That's not too shabby. Let's see if we can get a close up here. It's a Nulamog, as I heard people call him, because he's the new one. When you cast the Ulamog, the Ceaseless Hunger, Exile 2 target permanence, that's really good. Indestructible, that's really good. Whenever he attacks, defending player exiles the top 20 cards of his or her library. That is also pretty good. More so in limited than constructed, but still, wow. A force as voracious as time itself. Voracious? Voracious? I don't know. Let me know. Sunken Hollow, taps of blue and black. Enter the battlefield tapped unless you have two more basic lands. I believe these are called have lands. Now, to the viewers, which card would you most prefer to open of these two? Would you have preferred an Ulamog or a Sunken Hollow? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching this video and uh, hopefully I'll see you again next time. <laughs> Welcome back. All in all, a pretty, pretty okay. Booster opening. Now, I would like some comments on this video since this was the first one to help me evolve to make better videos. So you can do that either here on YouTube down below or you can tweet me on Twitter, logically, at BigBGamingSwe. I will put that in the description down below as well. So again, thank you for watching and I hope to see you back again.